we look at example 2, the shaded region in figure below is bounded by the curve x is equal to y squared plus 3 and the line y is equal to 5 minus x. So the question is, find the volume of the solid generated when by revolving the shaded region about the line y is equal to 5. So y is equal to 5 is in this line. So y is equal to 5. So you can see that the line of the revolution is a horizontal line. So if horizontal line, so we're going to use values of y and then function in terms of y. So we are going to use the value of y which is 1 and negative 2 and then our function must be in term of y. So this one is already in term of y but this line y is equal to 5 minus x so y is equal to 5 minus x so i need to change to in term of y i move negative x to the left hand side x is equal to 5 minus y so now our volume generally volume is equal to 2 pi integrate from a to b our function will be in term of y so ry times cy dy so first we're going to find the ry so you can see that for ry the line of revolution is above the shaded region so here is the shaded region so here is the shaded region and the line of revolution is y is equals to 5 which is above the shaded region and we will assume that the shaded region is y. So here is the shaded region. So means that our ry will be equals to the line on the top which is 5 minus the shaded region is y so our ry is 5 minus y whereas our cy so for cy so we were using right hand function minus left hand function so based on the shaded region, our right hand function is the straight line, which is 5 minus y. So it means that 5 minus y minus the left hand function. The left hand function is the curve, which is y squared plus 3. So minus y squared minus y squared plus 3. So minus y squared plus 3. So if I try to simplify this function, 5 minus y minus y squared minus 3. So here we have negative y squared minus y. 5 minus 3 is positive 2. So here is our cy. So next, we will substitute into the formula. So volume is equals to 2 pi integrate from a to b our a is negative 2 our a is negative 2 b is 1 so from negative 2 to 1 then our ry is 5 minus y 5 minus y times our cy our cy is negative y squared minus y plus 2, negative y squared minus y plus 2, dy. 
So negative y squared minus y plus 2. Go. Next, like the previous example, we will try to expand before we integrate. So expand 5 times negative y squared, negative 5y squared. 5 times negative y, negative 5y. 5 times 2, 10. Negative y times negative y squared, positive y cubed. Negative y times negative y, positive y squared. Finally, negative y times 2, negative 2y. dy. Next, I will try to simplify the equation or the function. So, start with y cubed. So, y cubed. Negative 5y squared plus y squared. So, it's negative 4y squared. Then negative 5y minus 2y, negative 7y, finally plus 10 with respect to y. So next, I will try to integrate y power 4 over 4 minus 4y cubed over 3 minus 7y squared over 2 plus 10y. So the value is from negative 2 to 1. Next, I will substitute the value. So 2 pi. So first, I substitute 1. So 1 power 4 over 4 minus 4 times 1 power 3 over 3 minus 7 times 1 squared over 2 plus 10 times 1. So this is the first value. Minus, next, I will substitute negative 2. So for negative 2, negative 2 power of 4 over 4 minus 4, negative 2 power of 3 over 3 minus 7 times negative 2 squared over 2 plus 10 times negative plus 10 times negative 2. So first we will substitute 1. Then we will substitute negative 2. So by using your calculator, you can try to calculate. So y, let's say y power 4 over 4. So this is a function. Minus 4y cubed over 3 minus 7y squared over 2 and finally plus 10y. So if I substitute the value of 1, what I have here is 65 over 17 uh, over 12 minus when I substitute the value of negative 2, I should get negative 58 over 3. You can use your calculator to calculate to verify this value. So next, this is 2 pi. So 65 over 12. Negative, negative will become positive plus 58 over 3. So from here, I should have 99 over 4. So finally, the answer will become 99 over 2 pi unit cube. So this is the answer for example number 2.